Ah, hello. Sorry. I didn't see you approach me. Yeah, I'm sort of just spaced out. Sorry. Mm -hmm. How's my day been? It's been fine. I was a little worried about my exam today, but I think I did pretty well on it. What about you? Ah. Oh. I see. That's good to hear. Should we get walking then? Ah, oh, of course. You know, I still can't believe it. How we met, I mean. I mean, it's still so strange for me to think about. I was waiting out a rainstorm that I got caught in underneath a bus stop, and then you approached me. You asked me if I wanted you to walk me home. You remember, right? And then we discovered that we are actually pretty close neighbors. Right down the street from one another, as a matter of fact. And then the next day, when I was getting ready to walk to school, you met up with me and asked if I wanted to walk together. I was pretty taken aback, but you didn't really mind. And now here we are. It's quite funny, isn't it? He took all the steps in order to make us as close as we are now. And I didn't do a single thing. What? You think I'm wrong? How? You think that I played a big part in forming our relationship because I was fun to hang around? I see. I'm really happy to hear that. I can't express it with my emotions, but it fills me with warm feelings when you say things like that. What do I mean? Well, it's a bit hard to describe. Maybe you understand. I'm not the best with expressing and understanding my emotions, but it's... Whenever I'm with you, I feel comfortable. I feel safe and warm, and I feel like all of my words don't matter whenever I'm with you. Whenever you laugh, whenever you smile, it makes me happy too. I get feelings of excitement whenever I see you approaching me, and I can't help but feel a bit upset whenever you leave. It's silly, isn't it? Having that kind of attachment for a person. I know it sounds ridiculous, but... Huh? It's not? What? You... You feel the... You feel that whenever you're around me? <laughs> That's a relief to hear. I wanted to know that I wasn't the only person feeling such strange feelings. I guess we're on the same boat, as they say, right? Well, do you know what kind of feeling this is?
You're better than me at understanding emotions, aren't you? It's embarrassing. Ah, uh, well. You don't have to tell me if you don't. Uh, your hand. Is there something wrong? Why are you grabbing my hand? I see. So, these strange feelings both of us are experiencing, you think that they're feelings of love? I see now. It's not like the kind of love you express with your family, right? I thought so. It's more. All this time, I thought I was acting strange. I had even thought I caught some kind of virus of sorts. <laughs> but I see now. Whenever I was happy around you, those feelings I had whenever you came and went, it was because, because I loved you, right? So, you felt the same way about me, right? Does that mean you love me too? <laughs> I don't see a reason to be so embarrassed about it. We both, we both just admitted our feelings for one another, didn't we? What? What? I, I just smiled. Really? Did... Did it look weird? I've never seen my own smile. Uh, you thought it looked cute. <laughs> That's good to hear. Why was I smiling? Well, why wouldn't I be? The person I loved just told me they loved me too. <laughs> I feel more happy than I ever have before. So, what happens after this? When two people like each other, they start dating, right? So, um, that being said, would you like to date me? Uh, uh, really? Well, you did just tell me you loved me, so perhaps I should have expected that answer. <laughs> Say, would you like to hold hands the rest of the way home? Okay, then I'll take your hand. I know it's repetitive for me to say this since you've already heard it, but I love you. Mm-hmm. <laughs>